sorry, y'all. My my lid. <laughs> to another vlog today is friday march the third i'm about to i just was able to get the kids out the house and brush my teeth and things of that such um i'm about to call my mom because today is my mom's birthday and i have not wished her happy birthday yet so we're gonna do that then make our coffee girl what is you doing you should just be waiting for me to call you. That's that's the only thing you should be having to do. <laughs> My mama ain't answer the phone, so I'm about to make me a coffee. I probably poured too much. Too much. I did not mean to pour that much creamer. Gracious. So today, honestly, I don't know what where's today, where today is gonna take me because I'm still kind of up in the air about it. One part of me really wants to just stay home and clean up and just clean up because I just really want to get my home organized. I've been I got finished doing all laundry yesterday and I woke up like early this morning to do the last load. So I just need to finish folding that, you know, and just like I'm gonna show y'all how it's looking right now. It's not terrible, but you just see how it's just stuff like shoes. It's just stuff out, you know? It's just stuff out. So I just wanna really spend today with getting the house in order because I feel like, what is that? But I feel like if I don't get the house in order today, it won't get done because tomorrow we are actually taking my mom to brunch. However, I did want to take her balloons today since today is her actual birthday. <sighs> by time by time this video is up, she, her birthday would have passed. So for her birthday, I actually scheduled her a hair appointment for March the 29th and went ahead and paid for it because my mom is the, the type of person that she will keep saying like, I need, I want my hair done. I need to do this. I need to do that and never do it. Like as far as taking like, going to do something for herself really i'm looking for the remote that's why i'm walking around oh it's right there right where i live right where i set my coffee <laughs> like she been saying a long like she told me a while ago that she wanted her hair done and i told her about this girl did she ever go no so i made an appointment with the girl so that is her birthday gift but um i do also want i'm thinking my sister was saying that she got her some pandora charms because she just got a pandora bracelet but I don't know. Like that's what we always lean towards when it's her birthday or something because she, we just be trying to add charms to her bracelet. But what I think I'm gonna get her is, cause I wanna get her something, you know what I'm saying? So that she could touch like now on her birthday because since the hair appointment is March 29th, um, I'm thinking about getting her some Crocs because she just be buying Crocs for the grandkids and she be asking like, is they really comfortable? If you own some Crocs, then you know that once you start wearing Crocs, other shoes don't matter. I got platform Crocs, regular Crocs, Crocs with the fur in it. You know what I'm saying? Like, you got to have variety. But So, I do want to do that. But I really need to clean up, you guys. Like, I'm just tired of living in chaos. Like, I, well, I can't even say it's chaos. It's just disorganization. And I just want organization. What's crazy is I started reading a new book called The Mountain Is You. And it was talking about how when you are constantly living in disorganization, that's because you're trying to avoid the actual things that you really need to do in life. And I feel like that is so true because if I'm constantly disorganized, I'm constantly thinking about, oh, I don't have time to do this, that, and the third versus whenever like I have a clean space, I'll be like, man, I got so much time. What do I do? So I need to clean up today. So I don't know if we're gonna be doing too much today, you guys, because I need to clean up. I'll probably show y'all what I bought because I did go to Target, Home Goods, TJ Maxx. Yeah, Target, Home Goods, and TJ Maxx. And I bought a couple of things 
from each place and I want to show y'all so we'll see where the day leans us but in the meantime y'all it's been like 30 minutes and my mama still ain't called me back Leave your message for seven, five, seven. <laughs> it's rainy outside today. Huh? Is it supposed to rain all day? Because if it do, I'm... Listen, I don't mix well with rain. Let me ask Siri. Hey, Siri. Oh, now she want to call me back. Happy birthday! <laughs> Thank you, man. <laughs> How does it feel to be 21 again? <laughs> what are you doing that you were so busy you couldn't answer the phone for me? I was talking to my other daughter that was calling to wish me happy birthday. Who? Dan. Oh, I come first. <laughs> Y'all, I've been in here working. Do you hear me? Working. So... I've been doing, you know, a lot of organization. Like I told y'all, I wanted. I organized my closet, you guys, because my closet was a mess. I do want to actually get like a, because you see how like everything looked like it's in place and folded. However, I want it to be like a closet system. Hold on, somebody calling me. So I want an actual closet system, like, you know, like the shelves and stuff like that. But right now, this is. What we have, which I'm very grateful because I have plenty of space. As you can see, I got two whole sides like that's not in use. Use only this side um, because I don't have a lot of clothes. And here go my shoes. Like I want some type of storage. And y'all, all of my underwear, sports bra, everything is in that one thing. I need like a dresser. I need to actually get furniture. Like we've been in this house for two years and we have not like got furniture furniture. So that's definitely my goal for this year. But right now, this is what we're doing. I organize everything on the top of my shelves, which is the main things I wear to have like a system of where I, I know what's what. So these are all leggings, gym leggings, gym shorts, gym shirts, gym shirts. These are just shirts that I wouldn't like not to go to an outfit or look nice in just you know shirts i can wear that's appropriate to go run an errand or something these are all cleaning shirts you see majority of them are white just in case bleach might get on them cleaning products it won't ruin it sweat shorts sweat pants sweat pants these are like i don't know it's like a satin dress and like a set that I will wear around the house like so just something that I would I still will wear that in the house but it's a little bit more nicer more fitted more sexier I guess this is all pajamas pajama sets onesies or whatever things like that these are shorts that I will wear in the house because I can't wear them outside because they're too hoochie these shorts that's on top actually these are a uh, fun fact about these shorts these are my dad's shorts I had went to their house one day and I it, we was just leaving the beach so I didn't want to go inside because I had on like a swimsuit and I, you know you don't want to be around your dad like that I did have a cover-up but it was like mesh so he gave me some of his shorts and I've had it ever since and it just reminded me of a, being a little girl where I always would steal my dad's stuff like my his clothes his night clothes his night shirts and he'd be like is that mine and I'd be like yeah but I always was wearing his stuff so I'm keeping this he's not getting it back all tank tops and leggings that I would wear in the house because it's either like stain or something like that and then I actually have this box let me show y'all what's in this box so this box is full of skim stuff y'all i probably had this for over a year i bought it and um i know it looks small but skim stretch a lot but i bought it and i really wanted to wear it once i achieved you know like i was comfortable with my weight because it was like fitted fitted shirts and stuff like that so i have all of this skim stuff and yeah brand new tags on it so i just keep it in the box so i can have it when i'm actually ready to wear it let me show y'all what i got from tj maxx and home goods and target <sighs> the background look bad but i promise y'all it's not as bad as it looked but i just want to show y'all what i got so anyway okay so i got this from tj maxx it was 39 dollars. it's just a hotel collection comforter 
and it was on clearance for 39 regular price 60. i was looking at ones in target but they were like 90 dollars. but it was the costa luna brand which is fairly more expensive but i just didn't want to go that route this time i want to actually decorate my bed because my bed doesn't have any type of decoration to it like it just looked like a bed it looked like a boy bed you know how they don't care really about what they bed look like <laughs> So I got that, and then I got these decor, dec, decorative, decor, decor. Bruh. I got these <laughs> throw pillows to put on the bed. I was really, oh lord, they're breaking apart. I was kind of iffy about it, y'all. But honestly, now that I look at it, cause I didn't even think about that before. If I really, I'm gonna see how I look with the tassels. But if I don't like it, I could just cut it off. Yeah. because y'all see how so it's kind of like a beigey color with a little bit of white in it black and then this taupey color it's the color of our bed frame and our bed frame the color selection that we chose is taupe but to me it pulls more just gray but i feel like that it would still be okay because it's not like off off so i got those pillows and then I also got these throw pillows right here because I was like how many throw pillows are you supposed to have so I got these I got those king size pillows continue on the bed saga I got these 100% cotton sateen two king size pillowcases because the pillowcases we have they would not fit those i didn't realize how big king size pillows are but they're huge me a electric candle lighter y'all know i had to get me a candle i can never go on tj maxx or home goods and not get no candle so i also got the, these what i'm about to show you these came from home goods so i got this wooden decor candle this wooden it's like um wooden it's a ceramic or stone I don't know because it kind of feel like stone or glass I don't know exactly what it it doesn't say but the fragrance is called cashmere wood and I mainly got it just for the look of it because the colors that I my theme for downstairs is kind of like gray and wood because I wanted to bring some type of warmth downstairs because everything is just so like white grays and I really don't care for cool tones I like how I look in houses but i do feel like we needed some warmth my next house i would definitely want to get like light brown floors and i also got this candle from the brand sand and fog it's strawberry mimosa it smells so good oh it smells so good so i needed a kettle because i be i make my tea with my keurig however the keurig i usually make it with for one, I don't like the idea of my water sitting in there. Like, you know how the water sits in the container for the Keurig? I don't like the idea of it sitting in there now. For some reason, I don't know why. I just like overnight, it just didn't sit right with my spirit. So, when I try to do the warm water, because they do have an option where you could put hot water, it can just push out water and no coffee if you don't have a K cup in there um but i noticed that it would still look brownish so it's like the residue from the coffee so i wanted a kettle and i was gonna get one of those like electric ones from amazon but i just liked how this looked okay so yeah it's one of the ones that whistle when it's done and i liked how it incorporated my colors which is the wood and then the stainless steel so i got that and then I also got some liquid chlorophyll, which my sister put me onto this. She told me that this really helps you not have any um, smell. So like must or if you might pass gas, like it doesn't smell. Or if you go, you know, do number two, it don't smell. And I did get some before, but I made an accident and put it inside of the refrigerator. And then it start, it got really like syrupy and it was no good after that. So I'm going to start mixing this in my water i also got some liquid collagen for hair skin and nail, hair skin nails and joints so i got this also and then i got 
some pink sugar crystals, y'all, because y'all know how I like to play with my drinks. So when springtime hits, I'm going to use that. I got also a milk frother because I wanted to use this to mix my, um, you know, whatever I need to mix my creamer or even if I'm mixing the chlorophyll into my water or things that like that. So this came from Home Goods. It was $5.99. And I didn't even know it came with a stand, which is perfect. So I could just sit it. Hold on, let me take it out. Okay, so it comes in a stand like this. And then it just has a power button at the top. And I also like how it's like a matte. It's not glossy. Can y'all even see it moving? But it's moving right now. It's moving fast too. But you can literally use it for anything that you need mixing. And if you don't want to, you know, really, you could just take a spoon or a fork. But this is, well, honestly, I feel like this would do a better job because it's so fast. You know how sometimes you might mix something with a spoon or a fork and it just doesn't, it's not even. So, yeah. So, that's all I got from TJ Maxx and Home Goods. Oh, no, it's not. Sorry, I lied. I also got some Honey Pot. Mm-hmm. Oh, y'all, awesome. I got something else but i'll probably show y'all tomorrow so i got two of these actually the honey pot um foaming sensitive wash now i don't know exactly if the formula has changed with this or not but i thought my mind said something and i said mine you might be right huh if they change the formula and you know like home goods and tj maxx and things like that they sometimes get products that like been on the shelves for too long or something like that or it might like be a defect that you we can't tell but it doesn't pass like um inspection before it leaves the warehouse so i was like maybe those are the old formula so i bought two and i also got a pajama set i'm trying to start being a pajama girl y'all because i don't be wearing pajamas now the skills pajama set i got it's kind of like this material um but it's long sleeve but i love that y'all i have washed it so many times it has not shrunk lost its quality nothing that i mean and as it should not because it wasn't cheap but i really liked it so now that's it from what i got from tj maxx and home goods as far as what i got from target i got this board i was gonna get a calendar they do have a glass calendar there that you could just write you know with a dry erase marker however i was like mm, the last calendar i had i really didn't use it. it it would be october and the calendar would say it's sept september or august so i just was like i just want something different so i got a glass desktop easel so you could just write up here and it's in your face on the desk i also got some oral b arctic peppermint oil um floss picks i tried one y'all i like it usually we just get the regular floss picks but i like it with the um peppermint on it i like that i got red pens because my my friend she told me that um uh, when you are writing like journaling and things like that it's good to write it in red pens i re-upped <laughs> i re-upped on the method hand soap from target that comes in this aluminum bottle it smells so good Mm, it smells so good y'all i'm tell if listen if i don't tell y'all nothing else go get this first of all it's cute you don't have to change the bottle because it's already cute they come in different um fragrances or scents but this one i like the pink and it just smells so good the one i got is vanilla and raspberry with plant-based cleansers i got me some um shade uh I can't think some razors some razors because I've been going to the gym more and wearing kind of like sleeveless and I ain't have no more razor I got me some down there wipes I really like these I did try the wipes from honey pot I didn't like them I like these the down there wipes are good I got me some libido supplements y'all and I used it I only used it for two days but y'all Y'all better go get y'all sign. I also got some black pens. These are my favorite pens, you guys. These are the only ones. I do not like any other pens. If you are a pen person, you understand. It's all about how the pen writes. And I love this. This is the um, G2, but it has to be number seven. Do y'all see that? Zero seven. Because I did get the zero five. Mm -mm. 
I needed some facial moisturizer so I got this from Clinique and even though I do use the Charlotte Tilbury one that I was putting y'all on I need some more and I didn't want to get it right now because I was trying to wait until my coupon became active from Sephora so I'm gonna use that and I got me a fitness journal so in here I'm able to write like today's focus food log can y'all even see it okay food log movement slash exercise today's self-care daily tracking water intake steps our slept because i was writing it in a notebook but just a plain notebook so i said i'm gonna get this because it's actually for that you know so that is all i got you guys now i'm gonna finish cleaning up okay y'all i'm about clean and everything is about clean up <laughs> When he put his head down, that's how he get him fa faster run. <laughs> anyway, I got this one pile left, but everything else, I still got the vacuum over there. I put everything that I showed y'all over here so I can take it out and put it where it needs to go. Bed is made. I decided that I'm going to just wait until um tomorrow to do the comforter and set up the bed because I want to do a TikTok on it. But, um... That's his nightstand over there. So I can, I tried to organize as best as I could, but he got to figure out that. Um, and mine's really ain't that much better, but I need to get something done with that too. But anyway, other than that, we are clean. I still got to clean this stuff over here. Y'all, I'm really ready to decorate my room because it's like we have... Clip! We have so much space in here, but we really don't have it decorated. Literally, the only thing that we have bought for this room is the bed frame and these nightstands. And even with the nightstands, I wanna get them replaced. I bought these nightstands first and they were too short. I didn't look at the dimensions. So that's why they're so small. And then I bought these ones um, to replace those. And which I do like these, I like the color of it. I feel like it go with the um, bed frame because it kinda has like, you know, you see the colors in it. It matches with the bed frame, but kind of warped because you see I keep my water bottle over there so it's just I want a new nice night, new nightstands but for right now they'll do and then that desk over there I don't know if y'all remember I was using that desk um when the twins was on formula I just had like a little setup right here where I make their bottles pampers wipes anything we need in the middle of the night because I don't know if you're new here we actually moved into this house like when the twins was we moved in April 1st the twins was born February 18th so they were not even two months so it just was so, such a transition that decorating the house was last on the list but I'm ready to decorate and yeah I'm kind of mad at how we have the TV because now if I was to get something right here like say for instance if I was to get a long table that fit this wall right being that the tv is not in the middle like let me actually back it up how it's supposed to be so y'all can see hold on okay so y'all see how the tv is not in the middle of the wall because at first our bed was over here so this was really the only place that it would make sense for it to go when the bed was right here because in order for us to see we, we would just turn the, the turn the tv but now I kind of wish it was like right in the middle because that's really gonna blow me unless I do like a table right here that does not go all the way down and then maybe like a plant right here I don't know y'all tell me what I should do leave some comments below but anyway I'm just finishing up as you can see he is getting into everything oh and I cleaned the bathroom let me show y'all the bathroom is nice and tidy nice and clean everything is clean 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 shower toilet room everything y'all we keep our toilet paper up there because this kept keep breaking off but anyway everything everything is clean i'm actually gonna put a candle in here right quick. i'm gonna put a candle in here right quick y'all hold on at first y'all i thought i was doing this thing wrong i said hold on wait now am i about to cause a fire but once you get the hang of it, fairly easy. And 
it does take longer to light than uh, just like a regular lighter, but it's okay because now I don't have to keep buying lighters. Hey you guys, good morning. Today is Saturday, March the 4th. Oh, today my brother and my birthday. His birthday is right after my mom's, so I need to text him today. But today is Saturday, March the 4th. Um, we are about to go eat breakfast with my mom. Remember I was telling y'all yesterday, um, Kehlani is with me. I decided to take her with me just to have a girl's day out. And I like getting her dressed and y'all know she's my first girl, so yeah. <laughs> So we doing that but right now i gotta go to target and i want to get her a jean jacket because it's supposed to be 69 degrees outside but she doesn't have a long sleeve jacket on she has a short i mean she doesn't have long sleeve shirt on she has short sleeve so i want to get her a jean jacket because her other jacket is just like a furry jacket and um and i need to get my mom a car and then we're supposed to be meeting them at 10 o'clock and um uh, Right now, I think it's like 9, 10 or something like that. So that's the plans for today. You want to see Kehlani with her baby? Let her go her hair, y'all. It's just like two sides. Great. Look at her being nosy. <laughs> Let's see if we can find this jacket. Well, I think I see it right here. Yep, it's an Oshkosh jacket with hearts on it. Uh, yeah, 2T. Yep. Yeah. Perfect. All right, let's go get a card for grandma. Okay, now we're looking hey, for a card. Baby. These are giving all childish. Um, let's see. Oh, they got one for mom. Oh, see, I like the words on this one, but what the I say? But it's giving old people. This print. I'm gonna get this one because I like it really what it say. Ooh. Oh wait, I like this one too. Oh, her jacket matching oh, she's so good. she loved that bear to death she wants to take it everywhere she literally made sure she had it to take it into target like she 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 would not leave the house without it so i rolled a window down because she liked having like the air on her when she when we on the highway y'all why did she throw that damn bear out the window she, this is her second time doing that her second time doing that and i know y'all like uh well Yvette why would you open the window again I wasn't even thinking about her throwing the bear out because the bear wasn't even like she did she wasn't holding on to the bear she had put the bear in the seat next to her so the bear could be in his own seat y'all she grabbed the bear I'm leaning because I'm on this raggedy tail tripod but she grabbed the bear and threw it out the window and last time she did it though I was able to go get it because we was on the street so I just turned around and went and got it but I can't do that on the highway like, I'm not about to get out the highway and risk my life trying to chase a bear. But I'm so mad because that bear was so nice. And she just got it for Valentine. We at the restaurant, y'all. Look at her. She always be nosy. Because he was going on. <laughs> Look at her. She always be nosy. Y'all see how she got Y'all, I'm vlogging off of my phone, so I'm trying to wipe it clean because Kaylani got it all dirty. She's even there taking pictures, you know, my little photographer. Okay. It look a little bit better, but um, the food was so good. Oh my goodness, that was my first time there, y'all. Food was so good. Okay, and my tab definitely reflected that because I paid like $104. But, um, look at them. It looks so blood. I'm sorry, y'all. My, my lip. <laughs> Girl! You better get my baby! You took a little bit too long getting her for me. Because I thought she was going to step down. And 
and then she started holding that. <laughs> you just made that shit funny. <laughs> Happy birthday. <laughs> y'all, y'all, you caught, we, we're all together, so we was like, let's just go ahead and FaceTime since we all together. <laughs> I appreciate it. You're welcome. Love you. Why? My mama, <laughs> my mama only want black Crocs. Go ahead. Six what? Yeah, I mean, these or <laughs> if I get... Yeah, another color like white would be the uh, white gonna get dirty real quick. Uh, is they too big too? Uh, yeah. We're gonna put the strap on the only thing that my toe is right here. So is that bottom of the toe right there? Yeah. It don't hurt. It don't so hurt. what about this one? Do that feel too loose though the other one? Guys, it's much later. I just freshened up to get ready to go to the movies. I got the same thing on that I had. Oh, Lord, my stomach poking, Lord Jesus. It's cramping, baby. You okay? So y'all know those Van Cleef bracelets? I'll put something up on the screen, like right here. Y'all know the Van Cleef bracelets, which is like expensive. They like 5,000, 6,000. Some of them is like, I seen one that was like, I think it said 20,000 or something like that. Crazy prices that I ain't paying, right? Yo, look what I found at TJ Maxx. I don't even know if it's going to pick up as far as like how good they look in person. But these are what I got from TJ Maxx. So I got a light blue one, a green one. Um, this is like a pearl color, dark blue and then black. This is the only one that's not the same brand as these ones. As you so these ones are by the brand Rachel Zoe. And then this one is by Alexa Tori. So these were $24.99 and this one was $29.99. Y'all see the clovers on these? This one is like a little bit bigger. But I guess it's a hot commodity. Because when I looked up online to try to like see if they had if they had like different colors, people were actually selling these on Poshmark for $70. This is how they look, you guys. They are, I'm probably going to split them up because I want to put them on, they're kind of getting a little bit tangled up. So I probably split it up. But this is how they look on my wrist. Me and babe are about to go to the movies to see Creed 3. So I'll see you guys there. Happy Sunday. It is 118. This is my first time getting on camera today because I'm looking for my purse. Anyway, y'all, I'm about to go to the grocery store so I can get some stuff to cook tonight. I think I want to do I want to do chicken wings, but I think I want to do buffalo bait chicken wings. I haven't did bait chicken wings in a while. So I think that's what I want to do. Um, the movie was real good last night. I stayed up the whole time. I thought I was going to go to sleep because I was yawning on the way to the theater. And then at the end, I saw my friend. And it's so crazy because when I had, I put up a status on Facebook about um, going to the movies. And she had mentioned that she was at the movies seeing it too. But I thought she was like already there. I didn't know it was the same movie. And when I was leaving out, my friend was there. So it was nice seeing her. But um, the movie was real good. Real good. The service was kind of, mm, you know, they she he was saying that they had a really busy night. The food might take a while. My food came. I finished eating my food. My boyfriend's food still didn't come. So that kind of was like, mm. but I need to cook dinner tonight. I also, um, I got to go back upstairs to get my... Money, hold up, got a cut up, lot of orders, dollars, quarters, wrist, water, reach, 
water, bitch. On a, on a, on a, wanna, come on, come on, on a, hey, I'm a stunner, stunner, summer, summer, mini, honey, cook up, hey, my crew, hey, show for way, pop it, pop it, sip it, a corn, rich, nigga, a one, baby, back in that a con, baby, but a pecan, bringing that on the refund, bringing that back till I see the sun, I fuck the bitch on the dick. Get on her knee. She only come with so, this is the next day now. I wanted to show y'all me actually decorating. I'm just talking to you. Hold on, let me turn the light on. I wanted to show y'all me actually decorating my bed. I put the covers up there last night, but I don't know if I love it, you guys. Can y'all see me? I don't know if I love it because let me show y'all. I'm gonna show y'all why I don't know if I love it. And I'm like, am I doing it wrong? Like, I remember I mentioned to y'all that I don't like the fact. I wish these tags said, this side goes right down. <laughs> remember I was telling y'all that I didn't like the fact that the other comforter did not go all the way to the sides, right? But this does not go all the way to the sides. And see, it does it go this way? No, it can't be this way, is it? No, because look how short it is. But I feel like, no, either way, it's so short. I don't like that. And then, is it supposed to be this long in the front? Let me back it up a little bit so y'all can see. Okay. Is it supposed to be this long in the front? I don't think so. Because, no, that's covering. I don't think it's supposed to be this way. We're going to turn it the other way. <sighs> but either way I turn it, it's still... I'm about to cut this off. I need some scissors. Hold on, y'all. Because this is just in the way, but now I really ain't going to know which way. Okay. I did not do a perfect job with tucking my covers, but honestly, you guys, I never tuck my covers, <laughs> but I needed to do it for the aesthetic. I think it's supposed to, hold on, wait, it's still not even on both sides. Let me bring this one a little bit over, just a little bit. I slept with it last night, it's very much comfortable. Now I feel like it's too over this way. Okay. So. Pick up the pillars. I'm going to go ahead and. I actually have the uh, pillowcases in the washer right now. I never knew how long king size pillows were. Like, oh my goodness, I'm never gonna be a standard girl again. So let's put the pillars. I'm trying to get this stuff over here out of the way. Ugh. to the end <gasps> there we go all right all right all right do the pillowcase is supposed to go inside as far as the little flap i don't know hey alexa does the opening to the pillowcase supposed to go 
To the left or right? From VeryWellHealth.com. The design lets you open it to add or remove the filling to reach your perfect level of support. <laughs> Alexa, does the opening to a pillowcase supposed to go to the left or right? From Deseret.com. The mantra for placing pillowcases is seam and slack to the center of the rack, open end to the left, which indicates the outside edge of the bed. Okay. There you go. All right, let's do the next one. Oh, now you can see the pillow. Now you can see the tags. I should have cut them, but I'll be damned if I take this back out. So we just gonna flip this on over. <laughs> Purr. Okay. See, this is too much. This, <laughs> I understand the whole, oh, you want a cute bed? <sighs> Baby, I just want to sleep. <laughs> All right. I bet you ain't never seen somebody struggle so much with a pillowcase. Okay. 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 All right, now for the pillows. Y'all, I really do not know. How are you supposed to go? So we're just gonna go ahead and cut this. Why do people be having these tags? I don't like tags. Like, who wants that hanging on their bed? Yeah. Cause I show, even though I already put it on the bed. I guess I didn't do the actual pillows because they're inside the pillowcase, but whatever. Okay, so how do we do this, you guys? Do they go like this? Hold on, y'all. I gotta set up for TikTok. Jesus. Okay. So how am I supposed to do this, y'all? How are the pillows supposed to go? Is it like this? Because I don't do this. Let me see. Oh, that's a little cute. Should I keep the tassels or should I cut them off? I'm going to keep them on until y'all let me know if you like them or not. Now, where, where, how are these supposed to go? Did I? Oh, wait. I should have looked up something on Pinterest first. Do I? Do these go? Uh. Oh, do these chop too? Oh, purr. Uh. This, this, this chop a little ugly, but it's not, it's not bad. Let me see. This a workout. Y'all be making y'all bed earn that like this. Jesus. Do this go like this? How that look, y'all? I 
it should be good. Let me see. to be like that. I don't like that, y'all. What am I doing wrong? Help me! <laughs> I can't look up no pictures because I'm on my phone. But how is it supposed to be? Do I got this too high up? <sighs> Let me see. How to put pillows on bed. Oh, I ain't got enough pillows. Need some color. This looks so plain. Alright, you guys. Well, well, that's it for this video, you guys. I kind of didn't have a good workout. I didn't complete all of it, but that's okay. We'll reconvene tomorrow. Um, I think that I'm going to take some of my bracelets off. I probably will just leave the black and the pearl one because they they're getting a little bit too tangled up for me okay somebody on my tiktok commented and said that they work at tj maxx and that these are um they don't tarnish because they're what is it called um what is it called when something is like stainless steel but it's covered with 18 karat gold. I work at TJ Maxx. We get these all the time and necklaces and earrings. I have some earrings because they're 18K gold plated and don't tarnish. Okay. They, they're they 18 gold plated. That's what I was trying to say. I'm hungry, y'all. The hunger is taking the words out of my mouth. And, okay, you guys. Well, today's Monday. This video was not even supposed to be going to Monday. It was only supposed to go until Sunday, but um, I wanted to show y'all me trying to do my bed because I told y'all we were going to do it in this vlog. So I'm about to finish putting this stuff up over here and then start cleaning up downstairs because everything is clean but downstairs. So yeah but i probably am going to relax for a little bit it's 12 38 i need to do some work um y'all know the twins is at daycare today was their first day of daycare i did vlog it what else but they did good they didn't cry other than that yeah i need to go ahead and clean up downstairs oh what I, my point is saying that was i have until six to pick them up and you know it used to be five o'clock but i have until six well y'all I love you guys. Are y'all tired of me looking a mess? <sighs> See you guys in my next video. Bye. That was so dry. Bye.